Hello, welcome. In this video, we're going to learn all about dome mountains and how they're formed. I'll give you a detailed step-by-step -step process to help you better understand and include some diagrams. While dome mountains are not as tall as other types of mountains, they are unique. They have a dome shape and this has been created over a long period of time from magma rising up. Let's jump straight in and take a look at the process. First of all, magma rises up to the Earth's surface. Once it has reached the surface, it then interacts with the rocks and pushes them up gradually. This is a very gradual process. It is not an explosive process, but it takes time and this gradual release of pressure creates a nice even dome. Then once the dome has been formed, erosional forces take place to create unique shapes for each individual dome mountain. So every mountain is completely different. Dome mountains can occur in many different places. This is again, makes them unique from other types of mountains. Fold mountains need to be occur at plate boundaries, but dome mountains can occur even in the center of a continental plate because it is magma that is rising up that creates this. A good example of dome mountains is the Black Hills in South Dakota. These have been created from magma rising up gradually and creating a nice dome shape. If you want to continue learning about mountains, check out my next video here. And if you want to get your hands on some free revision notes or some lesson PPT packs to save yourself some time, check out the link in the description below and head over to classroomnation.com. Thank you for watching and I hope you found this useful. 